Alright, so um, I hope the audio doesn't sound so bad. I'm gonna put a picture on screen of my current setup. Me and my girlfriend finally moved in to our new apartment and I, I don't have a desk. So I'm doing what I what I can. Uh, the audio is probably very scuffed just because um, walls, there's no, not much in the room so the, the sound rebounds on all the walls. Um, but it's okay. This is the thing I wanted to use. It's been a while since I wanted to use it, so I thought today would be the day. Roxy, uh, Brugal, and Lilia. I faced this team once while I was using um, the King team, and I lost. So I thought, you know what, team might be good, let's give it a try. Of course, Brugal uh, with Lilia, super strong, and then Roxy is proccing her whole passive because there's only humans in my team. So this should be good. CC food, so I can go first, hopefully. And... Um, yeah, I mean, if, if, you know, it all goes right, turn one, I should be able to just kill someone, and just turn two, three, should be done with the match. That should be it, because Green Roxy hits super hard, and then, you know, there's Rugal, which hits super hard, and Lilia is just buffing Rugal, really, she doesn't hit that hard, she doesn't hit hard or anything. Oh, wow, piercing. Hmm. Well, it's a bot. I mean, it just, it just do what, what I would normally do real quick. So this is what I think would be every single match. I AoE for Ox, AoE for Rugal, and then single target someone that I want to make sure to kill. Because like, look at Rox's damage. Okay. Um, yeah. That's what I want. I just kill. He has Red King in the back, yeah. So my Pierce was lowered, so Roxy didn't, didn't hit as hard as she um, would usually, but you know, that was still fine. Uh, I mean, this is it. Um, it's a bot, so I might as well go to the next one. His unit without a gear was Rugal. You could tell because he insta went below 50% HP with that Roxy AO uh, AoE, while not even like the blue units did, right? But, yeah. Alright. Mm -hmm. Okay, Lilia team. Oh, not Lilia. Liz team. <sighs> Ooh, I think there's an obvious choice. Let me do this, this, and this. Make sure uh, Liz dies twice. Oh, he crit Melody. That's unfortunate. Don't crit again. Don't crit again. What? What? You never crit Melly. Or you never crit in general because you have such low crit chance. Well, I'm gonna hope that he doesn't just kill me now. Mm, might be scared of AoE because of Rugal. Or not. Mm, definitely not. Uh, Rugal fully heals. Oh, but Roxy's dead. But Rugal procced his passive. If I get another Rugal AoE, it's done. Oh, I mean, I do have Death Pierce, so that might be why he crit. Okay, let's do this, this, and this. I don't know, I still think he wouldn't crit. Yeah, look at that damage, boy. Go for his passive, stopped procking as soon as uh, Merlin entered the field, because Merlin's uh, is unidentified, just like um, Gelfer. Yo! Okay. I mean, it's done. Rugal card. I mean, I got pretty lucky with the, the Rugal AoEs here. I mean, last last turn, if I had got an extra one, then it would have been even more lucky. But it's okay. That's it. Ha 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 ha. Alright. Ooh, he also sees me. That's not good. But I have a takeoff ultimate each card, in case he doesn't stun me. Alright, he's not pushing ult. Might be pushing shield. One thing though, I always forget. Does Goddess's Liz level 2 shield last for 2 turns or just 1? I always forget. Let me take a quick look. I'm stupid. I should be using Ludosia as a link for Lilia. Um, only 1 turn, so I might as well not even attack. 
And I'm just gonna go with this. I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna push Lilia's ultimate. He's gonna have to stun Lilia and not worry about my other units. Ooh, that's good. That's good. Okay, 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 okay. He's not doing much with his Meliodas, which is a good thing for me because I have like most of a green centric team. Like Lilia is blue, but she's not doing much damage wise, so. Okay. He definitely stuns Lilia. Yeah. Wish I got an extra Rugal card instead. I hope this kills him twice. Oh, not even close, wow. Not even close. Yeah, go going second really isn't good for me. I have to go first. I have to make sure to go first. Hmm. Could they still win? I don't know. I didn't create the melee, which is good. But he's gonna ult if, uh, his girlfriend has like three stacks. That's a big hit. Rugal full heals. Shield, he definitely elise. Roxy didn't die. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So here's what I'm doing. I'm gonna hope that this will work out. This should break the shield, and this should kill them. Okay. Nice, Bliss died. Okay, only math. Don't combine cards, don't combine cards, don't combine cards. Good, good, good. Rugal took it back. I could say Roxy. I mean, Roxy did good too. She broke the shield. Rugal would have not broken the shield. I say that because, uh, like, his AoE card just doesn't hit <laughs> on shield. Uh, maybe I'm singing too, too fast. If he kills Roxy here, which he will, yeah. How much does he heal? A lot, right? Yeah. I'm gonna attack weaken him by a lot. But I don't think it will be enough. And I ranked him up. He has three cards, yeah. The attack weakening won't be enough. Especially because he will AoE afterwards. Well, no, I should, I should go first. I mean, it's not like I have a choice, right? <laughs> Can I take the ultimate? If... If he didn't have the second attack, I would have won. If he was only Meliodas, I would have won. That's crazy. Rugar tanked a lost vein ultimate. That's crazy. Best unit in the game. Alright, oh, this is annoying. An annoying person, I see. Okay, 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 okay. The best thing for me to do would be to kill his star meal as fast as possible. Mm. This won't hit that hard. He's super, like, weakening me. Oh, but that killed his Tarmio. That's good. That's really good. A cleanse would be really good. Very, very helpful. Yeah, going Gil Thunder. This is a super tanky team. Like, uh, <laughs> I faced one of these the other day. Um, the guy was really smart. He got a level 3 from Tarmio turn 1. And I didn't have a stance removal. So, like, he just... Like, I had no chance. Like, I... At that point, I just had no chance. Level 3 counter. Hmm. Hmm. Get her ultimate. <laughs> just go with that. He can't remove it. Yeah, <laughs> I, just, I mean, what else could I do? Like, there was nothing else for me to do. The only thing I could do is push an ultimate. Because, uh, I mean, level 3 counter from Asteros. Have you taken one? 
recently? Yeah, it hurts. Uh, oh, another guy is listening. They go first. Yes. Okay. Let me go with this. I'm gonna hope Rugal doesn't crit. Roxy most likely will. Okay, good crits. Can I kill her twice? No. Don't crit Melly. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was not good. Who is he killing? Roxy? No, really. Rugal's passive proc, but... Hmm. I need to kill with Yodis, but how? I can't. I could attack weaken him. Yeah. I could attack weaken him. That can be good. No crit. Nice. That would show attack weaken you saw from the last match, or last last match, that he managed me. It managed Rugal to tank an ultimate from him, so it's really good. Yeah. Really, really good level show attack we can. No! Mm. He healed a lot, but I don't think it's enough to tank this. Because of course Mali heals quite a bit with his uh with his cards. I was hoping it would kill this. Crit? Yeah. 80k from level 1 type disadvantage is quite good. And the Rox is a very, like I want to say, um, weird unit. So when she wants to hit, she hits. When she doesn't, she's not very good. You get a shield? No stun. Rugal again? That's unfortunate. I mean, it's worth doing this. It's definitely worth doing this. Kill. I think it kills, yeah. yeah. My only worry was Liz, because if she ults, then ugh. It's a, it's a nightmare. Like five more turns of just waiting. I mean, I would have got his ultimate, but yeah, this is uh, what would happen following turn. I would assume so. I mean, let me let me let these uh, let me let, let me let them attack first before the ultimate. Listen, she hits hard. It's just that in comparison with with uh, Rugal, right? It's not very fair. Like, <laughs> it's just not fair to compare. Why would, why do I think that she used to hit harder? Maybe my other team setups were better for her, but this is a really good team setup for her. Like, I'm boosting her peers. I mean, maybe it's because with Kyo and and um, Easton, all her stats were being buffed. So that might be it. Just the peers isn't enough for her. I think, I think she really requires that a crit chance and crit damage to really be good. But she, she's doing quite well. But would I prefer, you know, taking off Kyo and uh, taking off Rugal and putting up Kyo? I don't know. Oh yeah, that's a lost match. Um, let me let me let me tell you what's gonna happen first turn. He's gonna activate his ability, and his team will become invincible. Or no? Or he? Um, wow. <gasps> oh, if he had fallen below fifty, like if he had fallen below fifty with the AOE, I would have just fully healed. I would not have died. That's so... that's so unlucky. That's so unlucky. He had like 51% HP or something. That's unlucky. Yeah, and then Rugal would have killed. 
But no, he had to just... He had like 51% HP. That's really unlucky. Well, I have no chance. What can I do? Alright, last match. Ooh. Very original. Um, haven't seen one like this in a while. Oh, he's barely got an extra card, of course. Okay. Roxy, get, a, get like a crit on one of your hits. And I think you can kill Liz. Crit? No. No crit melee, somehow, please. You crit melee? Okay, no crit melee. Nice. Well, if he drops Rugal below 15, doesn't kill him, I'm in a good position. Go for it. Going for Gopher's ultimate. Stun Rugal, of course. Well, unlucky for him. This is what I'm doing. A little laggy. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> Can you kill me wrong? No. Ah, oh, very close though. Ah, <sighs> he have those melee cards. It's a real play, it's very laggy. Like clicking the cards, it's very laggy. He just doesn't want to lose last thing for some reason, I guess. The pride. You go, level 50? Nice. Okay. Uh, you, ho you ho will hopefully break the shield, Rugal, because this doesn't break it. Yeah, very close. But yeah, this, this should break it. And then Troll Pierce. Very nice. I mean, it was uh, overall good results. If I go first, I basically guarantee win, sort of. I don't know, there, there's, oh, Sauriel is way too good, like, the one Sauriel we faced, you saw what he did, like, he just absolutely annihilated me, like, Lost Vein doesn't do in turn one what Sauriel can do, it's not even close, like, he's just so, so much better than Lost Vein in, like, turn one scenario, I think, if Lost Vein gets those rank threes, which, it's not like it's like impossible for him to get like rank 3s, right? You just need to, you know, ma match the condition of getting crit on. If Lost Vein manages to get those crits, I think he is better than Sariel. But like, turn 1, level 1 attacks, Sariel level 1s are so much better than Meliodas. Like, he just... You see how hard he hits, it's just crazy. Alright, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. The, the human team's fine. I think uh, Kyo and Easton w would be a better pair for... Um, Roxy, but we're gone. Lily did well. Did well as well.